Today, the choice has literally exploded. You can get almost anything you crave as a ready-to-eat meal. One of Singapore's favourite crustaceans is now available as a ready meal, waiting to be saved any time you want. All you gotta do is get yourself down to a vending machine. Look at this big boy right here, the crab vending machine. So we've got three options, chili crab, black pepper crab, salted egg crab. What I want is right here. And look at this, we have an option to either have it hot or frozen. House of Seafood started as one businessman's risky investment in the culinary world. But the success that followed has invigorated him to go beyond the restaurant. This is a really good idea, but unfortunately for me, I'm also a chef. And uh, the chef part of me is questioning. Questioning this whole premise right here, because anything fresh that goes in and gets frozen would be affected in terms of texture. Something has to be sacrificed for this sort of convenience, for this sort of technology. Three, two, one. Whoa! Right, guys, this is hot, this is fresh. I really want to get right in there right now, but I can't because I'm going to meet the man behind this first. Francis is the owner of House of Seafood, and he has spent more than a million dollars and three years to put his crabs into vending machines. Each meal costs a pricey 80 Singapore dollars, but the machine accepts both cash and card transactions. And the eating can start five minutes after payment. The smell is chili crab. Yes. This is original chili crab. Singapore chili crab. I haven't tasted it yet, but it looks and smells exactly like what you would expect. Now, what gave you the idea to put chili crab in a vending machine? Many customers ask me, especially tourists, how can I bring my chili crab overseas? Because many of their friends heard about this chili crab but got no chance to taste it. That's triggered me on that, you see. And you know what? I didn't come all the way here <laughs> for nothing. So that's the sauce yes. right there. That's good chili crab. If I close my eyes, right, I would never have guessed that this was something that was cooked maybe weeks ago or whatever, you know. Yeah, this crab is about four months old. Four months uh, old. That's right. Getting a crab cooked four months ago to taste fresh is not just about putting it in a container and sealing it. So first, you have to make sure that the claws do not pierce the vacuum pack because if that happens, the package is practically useless. And second, crabs go bad easily. So in order to keep them tasty four months in, you need to preserve them immediately after cooking. Huh, I know uh, this guy. Come, come. You know him? We've met before. Oh, <laughs> you're the first person outsider to view inside my secret. Okay, tang tang. Whoa. Yes, it's a fully automation. All the chili crab sorted, all with reference number. Okay. Okay, with all the expired date, all stated here. Okay. When a hungry customer orders their favorite crab at the vending machine. An automated lift will recognize the barcode of each container and deliver it directly to the microwave. The machine can hold up to 100 pieces at a time. And with smart technology, Francis' staff will be alerted when stock is running low and the top-up is due. Comparing like a restaurant to this, what are the efficiencies here? The restaurant operation usually about nine hours. But for this, we can reach out to 24-hour customer. So if I'm out having a, a night of drinks and I'm craving chili crab at 3 a.m. and the restaurant's closed, I can still get myself my fix. All right. And so if I uh, if I chose uh, pepper crab, then oh, what happens? Oh yeah, let me choose it for you. Um, oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. This is bad no, no, no. Crab. You really don't have to. You really, yeah, you really take it. Okay, if you okay. insist. Yes. Okay. Okay. We put it in the microwave now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <Let's take it. laughs> I have to admit. Francis has sunk his hooks in me. My appetite for these tasty crabs is raging. But before that, I'm really keen to find out just how he does it. Having delicious local cuisine served from a vending machine is fast becoming a trend in Singapore. At current sales, turnover can easily go beyond 1 million US dollars a year. And businesses in Japan and Taiwan have shown that these machines can bring in big profits and fast. I'm headed to meet Francis and learn how his house of seafood has made Singapore's iconic chili crab available as a ready meal from a vending machine. 
Okay, this is the production line. All right. The one box you must put at least two claw. Yes. Okay, the meat, everything must be in place. It must be a whole crab lab. These containers are customized for Francis. Made from polypropylene, they are safe to microwave and specially designed to bear weights of over one kilogram. You see the way they pour the sauce? Yeah. So you must pour the sauce first before you put the cover. Got it. Okay, so there's a good generous yes. amount of sauce. How many spoons of sauce? Depends. They've got their weight. After this, they put on the waiting scale. Yeah. And then the lid goes on. We've got to make sure the lid is nice and even with the top. Evenly, yes. These are so heavy, I can yeah, work out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One for one kilo. Cool. Portions are huge. All right, very big crab, <laughs> is it? So this is the one full crab. You can see, wow. not above it. Just nice. nice. <laughs> very precise, right. yes. Okay, the next part I want to show you is more important. That yeah. one, if you don't master it properly, I think the whole crab can throw away. Oh. Francis takes me further into his central kitchen and shows me the real engine of his success. Come, come. This is the one I'm talking about. Ah. This is uh, a tailor-made brass freezer. It's minus 45 degrees. Okay, come. We have a look. You can see it's so big. Ooh. Let me show you this. This is all the crabs. One by one, all waiting to brass freeze. This meat will definitely stay fresh throughout the one year. Yeah, you're just cutting down the amount of exposure, yes. right? Getting it in there as fast as you can, cooling it down as fast as you can. Yes. And only a big machine like that Correct. can meet your requirements. I went through a lot of country to get them to uh, advise me what to buy. And they told me that crab, no way you can do vacuum bags. I went through Taiwan because that site is very good and ready to eat foods. Even there, nobody do vacuum fat crabs. So I went to Italy, I went to Germany. Finally, I customized my, my machine. Three years and a million dollars later, Francis finally got that tailor-made machine that he needed to push ahead. Beside this brass face machine, tailor-made, I think i show you another one it's more interesting. That one also customized. Also customized. Also I customized. would not expect any less from you now. This is the vacuum bags. Come, let's press. One, one, two, one, two three. three. Press. You see? Uh -huh. Interesting. And how long does it stay in there for? Very fast. You suck out all the air, everything, and then you come up. This is called vacuum packs. This is the one. Everything sealed tight. It can last for one year without preservative effort. Yes. Uh -huh. So, since you know all my secret here now, not all. I think it should be all already. So, can you help me? Inside, they still got 60 packs. Can you help me to pack? Hmm? Okay, come. Thank you. Bye bye. After doing some free labour, it was my turn to play hardball with Francis. I'm very happy for you. I've tasted it, obviously. I know it tastes good. But the fact is that there are other people out there who may have something against the idea. So I think the real challenge here is not how I feel or how you feel. It's about how other people feel, the man on the street. All right. So can I issue you a challenge? Yes, I take out a challenge. So we're going to put this crab out on the street and get people to taste it. And now if they can't tell that there's anything different about this at all, then we really have a success on our hands. Are you up for that? Yes, I take out a challenge. Ha! Uh, all right. I'll let the crab do the talking. It was time for the crab to do the talking. I've even brought a special hat to help me attract people for this taste test. And of course in Singapore, the best place to find a crowd is around the shopping mall. Chili crab? Why? It's very good. Hey, man. You want some crab? I got crabs. I got crabs. Auntie, I'll see you here. I'll see you more. And I'll see you Ah! Oh! Miss, 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 miss. Want to try some chili crab? Very, very special chili crab. Okay. Putting the business deals on hold. Tell the secretary to avert all calls in the meantime because we're going to try some crab for the next three minutes. Okay, so when you taste it, think about the taste, think about the texture, let me know what you think. Take a couple of moments, <laughs> enjoy it, savour it, and let me know what you think. Try the sauce, try the meat, let us know what you think. Ooh, the sauce is so gooey. Woohoo! Nice. Yeah, quite nice? Yeah. Okay. It's fresh. Fresh? Yeah, there's no fishy taste about it. No fishy it. taste, yeah. all right. The sauce is all right. I just felt that it was really fresh, the meat was very fresh and very tender. The sauce is, is, is incredibly nice. Better than the other ones I've tasted. Is it good? Is it good? Juicy. Juicy! What if I told you that the crab you're eating right now 
was cooked six months huh? ago. Uh. <laughs> six months ago, you believe it? And then we warmed it up today. Today only? Today only. And it's so fresh. You can't believe it. Yeah. Six <laughs> <laughs> what do you feel about it now that I've told you that, you know, this is a packaged product? I'm surprised and I will definitely buy it off the vending machine. Yeah, oh. You don't have to go to the coffee shop to buy it. I mean, it's so easy. Why not just get it off the vending machine? Reasonable. You will buy it. I will eat it again. You would eat it again? Yeah. Ah, she would pay money. <laughs> full price. I want to share the results with you. I hope you're excited to hear I'm about excited. them. I'm excited. I'm excited. As much as I am excited to share them with you, because you know what? For the most part, it was a great success. Most people that I asked could not tell the difference between this and freshly cooked chili crab. See, that's what I told you. In that case, I think challenge success. Thank you. Thank you. Right? I got to scoot off to many other places. I'm going to get the crab out of here. Good luck to you. Francis. Thank you. You may call Francis a dreamer, but he is not the only one. Some 30 local food companies are keen to put their vending machines all over Singapore. By 2018, there could easily be up to 300 or more food vending machines all over the island. Francis hopes to roll out another 100 vending machines offering his signature crab dish by the end of next year. He believes a 20% increase in profit is achievable. What's more? By exporting his frozen, ready-to-eat crab meals to foreign markets, sales could potentially triple. For the most part, people were very, very accepting of the idea that you could put chili crab, such an iconic, such a premium dish, into a box, freeze it, and then sell it out of a vending machine. 